the Irvine Fine Arts Center, there's a class where you can create and make a piece you'll want to wear and be proud to share your newfound skill with others. It's called Creative Fabrication. The first thing we do is have them make up components that have no purpose. That way they can't fail. The goal is what happens if I take a hammer and I hit a piece of metal, what happens? Not am I making a ring. In the end, they take all those things and they turn it into jewelry they can walk away with. So you okay. always, when you're putting, you take it to a little tweezers and when you put it down, you put the clean side down, the tape side up. Sherry Cohen also teaches untraditional tips to make the process easier. We learn how to use, for instance, if you're twisting wire, you stick it into a drill bit and you lock it in on the other end and the wire goes instead of just twisting and twisting and twisting and twisting. We're learning how to solder and, and heat metals and cut them and just use the tools that I've never even used before in my life. You know, I'm a painter basically and it's like this is a whole new avenue that I've turned on to, but I love, love, love it. And Sherry is an amazing, amazing teacher. Lynn Lampert shares with us one of the main reasons she signed up for the class. I've always wanted to do this. My husband was a big um, gym cutter and I lost him four years ago and we wanted to do this together. So he's kind of here with me right now. So, In order for copper to solder, go dig soft or ball, what color does it have to be? Red hot. Red hot. Okay, see it all going red hot? Now we go right to the tip, and now you see the orange. Share ideas, learn from each other. That's a great thing, too. And there's all different levels. Everyone has different, you know, tools and experience um, and techniques. So we all really enjoy that part, too. As you get older, you need to keep your brain active, and this does definitely keep your brain active. And it's fun and it's enjoyable. You get to meet a lot of people. It's a very good social outlet and it's relaxing. People find new friends and new interests within the center. They go and they do things together like going to the gem show. It is something that expands beyond the classes. And so for all of us who are here, this is a critical part of life. It's a critical part of growth. We have people who come to these classes generational. There is an ever expanding need and appreciation of everything that we do. One, two, three. For more information on this class and others offered at the Irvine Fine Arts Center, you can visit their website. For Irvine Scene, I'm Jacqueline Twagg.